with the introduction of GORUCK as the official footwear and apparel provider for the CrossFit Games, let's talk about the five options that you have right now on the GORUCK website for footwear. There's color options, but let's get to what we have available. Now, GORUCK is mostly known for the backpack lineup that they've produced and the events that they've done in the past. A few years ago, they dove into footwear with the Mac V1 boots. We'll talk about boots here in a second. But what you really care about right now is this ballistic trainer. Did my first review of the ballistic trainer a few years ago, and since then it continues to be my CrossFit shoe of choice. It is super stable and love it for everything that it is. More about it as I compare it to the other shoes, but several colors available. I'll list them up over here if you wanna know what colors. I'll show some pictures along the way, but this is the ballistic trainer. Several colors available. It is fantastic CrossFit shoe. The next shoe you're going to want to know about is the Rough Runner. Now this, is, I've got about over 100 miles on my Rough Runners. They're a firm running shoe. Again, lots of colors available in the Rough Runners. This is a blue and orange, which is super cool. The tread is still not really showing much wear after probably about 125 miles. As a firm running shoe, it balances very well with a Ballistic Trainer. Ballistic Trainer for a workout that maybe has a 10% run component but mostly lifting. This is a good transition shoe for anything more running wise in your Metcon. You'll wanna try these. It's firm enough to do other basic Metcon activities. So there you go. The two primary shoes that I use for GORUCK and for CrossFit activities, the Ballistic Trainers and the Rough Runner. If you're gonna go more rucking and outdoor focus, they have a trail focused shoe, which has a very aggressive tread. Again, lots of colors available in the McCall trail shoe, which is pretty similar, I would say, in upper compared to the Rough Runner, but again, it has the Mac V2 style bottom. So again, just, just covering the rest of the footwear lineup right now, we have their boots, which their primary boot right now is this Mac V2 second iteration of the boot, totally different, more wider toe box and a more aggressive tread. They still make Mac V1 editions, but they only really sell this one, the high speed, available in this taller eight inch and a shorter six inch a lot. I did pretty much identical to the Mac V2s. The difference between these two boots is the high speeds are pretty much destructured on the inside. They're very, very comfortable boots. These are my go anywhere, do anything, ruck, wear them all day, go on a trip. If you have one pair of boots for everything, this is it. A little less aggressive tread, sort of a medium between what you see on the ballistics and what we see on a Mac V2 boot. Either way, that's the lineup available right now. If you're getting into go ruck footwear from boots, shoes what are they going to come up with now probably some more colors the next couple months as we get into the crossfit open season and dive into the games later on in the year so that's the lineup of shoes from go Ruck available right now thanks for watching i do a lot of reviews of go Ruck gear gear to get you outside i've covered most of their backpacks so if you're interested in more of the go Ruck lineup i'll put a link to my playlist of all the other GORUCK gear that I've reviewed over the last couple of years. With that, get outside, see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.